Hello YouTube, this is Daniel, back with another knife review with nothing you've ever seen. We have a real treat today from Topps Knives. They make some great knives and today I have one of them. Today I have the Alaskan Harpoon. If you have seen my uh, Hoffman Harpoon video, so this is called Harpoon because it kind of looks like the uh, Harpoon, so this is the Alaskan Harpoon came in a great looking sheath very versatile looking get your belt in there uh, I guess all their knives come with uh, some paracord attached which is just a plus in my book great sheath has this little feature has on top of the sheath has a little pouch pretty deep you could actually put another little pocket knife in there but uh, I've never seen that before so Nice little feature on this sheath. And here we are, the Alaskan Harpoon. This is an amazing looking knife. The overall length on this is one foot. So one foot knife. You got 12 inches uh, tip to tip, so tip to the end. So it's, it's not a small knife at all. If, if you're looking for a smaller knife, this is not the one to get, but let me tell you, this knife has so many awesome features about it. Uh, w one thing that caught my eye straight off the bat is the, uh, is the handle. It's made with black linen micarta. I do not know exactly what that is, but it is, it is really great. The feel on the knife handle, uh, the look about it. It has these uh, two little finger finger areas to hold with and those handle fits really nice all the way through with your arm uh, just feels like an extension it's really nice uh, sharpening a stick or whatnot shaving uh, bark off a tree and one thing I like about this is that the blade is really heavy the blade is very very thick blade the thickness of this is a quarter inch you do have a quarter inch thickness on this knife so it is very very thick and and the one thing that comes along with a heavy blade uh, and a thick blade like this is chopping capabilities. You you could really be able to chop with this knife, and I'm going to show you that uh, in a moment after I after I do my initial review. And I'm also going to have some slicing uh, demonstrations so that you can see that this knife is versatile. It's not just a big rugged knife to chop around with, but you can actually get a little precision action in there as well. Alaskan harpoon right there on the on the blade the tops tops knives logo it's made with 1095 uh, high carbon alloy RC is 58 so it's a nice hard steel uh, I've had knives that been made from 1095 high carbon and uh, nothing but good good things about them uh, easy to sharpen holds its edge really well you can constantly sharpen it and it won't it won't affect the knife I, I, I've never seen any chipping or whatnot on the 1095 uh, blades, but this is this is a heavy a heavy heavy knife with with many many uh, functions that you could use it for. The weight without the sheath is 0.95, so you do have a, a knife that's about a pound here with the sheath. It's 1.25, so a pound and a quarter. Not not bad for for a knife this this functional with this type of weight with this chopping capability and precision. Uh, cutting which I will show you in a moment comes with a paracord on the back very very nice thick full tang all the way through good handle this is one of the better knives I've, I've seen just cuz little, uh, little of a, a cool look there at the top kinda comes up at the top and then comes back down to a point uh, like they say on their page for this knife, it, it had, does resemble a harpoon, so that's where the idea came from. Nice blade shine to it. Uh, I like the coating on this, black traction coating, just like on the Hoffman harpoon video. I, li I love the coating, it feels nice. I've had knives that have had this coating, and uh, again, nothing but good things about it. Handle, blade, weight, chopping, I'll show you that. Uh, great knife very very sharp very versatile the sheath that it comes with is also very great 
with uh, two Velcro, Velcro straps to put that on with and you could uh, stick that onto your belt. Comes with a, a nice plastic uh, in, inside of this, this nylon, this uh, combat ballistic nylon sheath that they have. So great survival knife. You could use it, since it's such a thick knife, you could use it to pry things out. Great knife to have uh, in a survival bag. A great addition. Big and uh, versatile. So I'll show you now the, the uh, chopping and uh, cutting slicing capabilities of this. So keep watching. All right, I have a tomato here. And I will be showing you... Uh, some of the uh, slicing capabilities of this uh, Alaskan Harpoon. Uh, because it is a quarter inch thick, it's, it's not going to be the thinnest knife, so it may not cut all the way through perfect uh, slices, but it is sharp and, and you do get some, some pretty good uh, slices here. So you get nice and thin, just very, very sharp all the way through. The tomato's not smushing at all. Uh, it's, it's, it's very, very sharp, so it just goes to show that it is it is capable of doing uh, not only the chopping but also uh, slicing for this knife so I mean this is a great great uh, feature for this knife to be able to uh, cut such a uh, fine pieces um, like this so uh, great knife and uh, next I'll show you the chopping alright today earlier I showed you the knife itself and some of its slicing capabilities. Today I'm going to show you some of its uh, chopping capabilities on this 2x4. Good tomato.